Alright guys, my name is Frank. I hope you all are having a very Merry Christmas Eve. And this is going to be the Christmas special. We're going to be doing up the brand new Comet in the game, or the Retro Comet, which makes it look like an old Porsche 911. So, I really, really, really like it in this yellow, so I'm not going to change it. So, we're here, finally, in my custom auto shop. Because the last time I tried to record in this was with the Chiron or the Chiron and the video footage corrupted, so that was kind of bad. But anyway, let's go on to the customization of this thing. Now we can have some fun with her. Um, yeah, we can have some fun with her. Holy moly, man. Bloody hell. Look at the back end. Jesus, that arse, man. Bloody hell. <laughs> that is insane now. Basically, it's like RWB'd out apart from the spoiler, but I do presume we will be getting that in a little minute. Makes sense in these troubled times, I guess. Makes sense in these troubled times. We've got a freaking blooming three-floor garage. I don't think I'm troubled in this game, so shut your mouth, bitch. Anyway, I'm actually quite interested to see what else we can do on this thing because there's a lot of customization options. That looks ugly as fuck. Uh, no thank you. Um, that's relatively okay. But in terms of cleanliness, that doesn't look too bad. I'm going to stick with the stop bumper on that one. So the rear bumper, oh, we've got a little diffuser on the back as well. Ooh, I don't mind that. At least it's subtle, if you know what I mean, because with the other bumpers, it's a bit in your face, but at least that's kind of subtle looking. Large diffuser. Kind of tempted by that. Uh, yeah, why not? We'll go for it. Can add something to the back of the vehicle a wee bit, but let me know in the comment section below, guys. What have you done to your... I'm just going to call it a Porsche 911. Just let me know what you've done. And what is the point of a strut brace here? I'm just saying because it's a rear-engine car. It is a Beetle. Oh, sorry, Porsche, after all. Uh, yeah, I uh, forgot about that. <laughs> but yeah, engine tunes. We're going to go fully up. Because I took a little bit of a test drive along here in the normal Comet, um, and it's still really, really good. One of the best cars in this game, but I don't know how this is going to be. I'm really, really excited to see what it's going to be like. It's a titanium, big bore exhausts. Ooh, the Shakatan exhausts. I actually quite like the these ones right here, the way they kind of angle up. Just don't it's very nice, it. very nice indeed. So we do get... Fenders, fender vents. Mm, not a big fan of that, I have to say. Definitely not a big fan of that. Not my style. I kind of like them clean like the way they are right now. So the bonnet, or the hood in this case. Ooh. Hmm. They look pretty nice. I normally do go for these chrome style ones, but that's kind of catching my attention. Excuse me, guys. Having too much coffee today. Uh, so we can change the hood style. That is pretty good. Street hood. Oh god, no. No, thank you. Uh, ducted hood. Hmm. That, that looks relatively 911-ish, doesn't it? Like the proper old one. I kind of like that in terms of clean factor, man. It adds something. It's very good. Uh, we'll take another quite flat down. Hmm. I'm either tempted by this one, guys, or that one, um, where is it, this one right here. Uh, I think we'll go for this one. We'll go for this one. It does add more of a Porsche front end. I'm really, really glad Rockstar finally brought in, like, an old 911, because I've been asking for it for a long-ass time. Let's go for a loop on this one today. Since it is Christmas, we may as well, right? <laughs> Right, so we've got a lot of customization. To All right, Horn, you can shut up now. Shut up, Horn. There we go. Thank you. <laughs> uh, so we have got a sun strip on this thing. Um, I don't know. That kind of makes it too WRB-ish or RWB-ish for me. WRB. What the fuck am I talking about? Um, I think we'll go without it. I'm not really a big fan of it. So trim colour on the inside, what does that affect? It affects that bit right there. So since it is yellowish on the outside, 
We shall go for yellow on the inside as well. Look at that! Oh, me likey likey. Dashboards. Oh, we can change the dash and everything. Yes, please. Carbon fiber. That'll do very nicely. Because it's going to be kind of like an old race car, man. But me and Andy have kind of wanted like a singer styled 911 in this game. But hopefully, when Forza decides to bring in uh, Porsche to Horizon 3, which I have a funny feeling is going to be the next expansion. Um, I hope they bring in Singer versions because they are very, very nice indeed. Uh, I don't really want to change the door panels because I kind of like what they've got going on right now. kind of like that design, so we're going to leave it. The seats. Oh, we can change the seats. Sports seats. I'm going to need to go into the third person view for this because I don't know why when I'm changing seats I need to actually see them on the outside view here. Uh, it's got a lot of options for this car, man. Life is hard when you can have anything. Ta! <laughs> a wish in. A freaking wish. Holy shit. Life is hard when you can have it in. I fucking... Alright, so we'll go for these carbon sports seats right here. Steering wheel. Hmm, I want kind of like, like a proper classic one. Oh, that looks good! That looks fucking cool! I like how it's yellow in the freaking centre of it. Please tell me there's... Oh my god, there is more like that. Oh, that one's got Comet on it as well. Oh, I want it to be colour-coded though. Yeah, we're going to go for this one. That is badass. The light colour. We shall go for... I'm thinking of... Oh, god, the yellow. Everything's going to be yellowed out, but I think we might go for a blue with this. Like, yellow and blue, because that colour does kind of go. We'll just see, won't we? Bugger it, we'll just go for the yellow. We'll have everything colour-coded. The roll cage? Have we... Oh, we've not even added one yet. Holy moly. And, yeah, we'll take one of these, won't we? Since it is meant to be kind of like our old She's classic racing 911. We'll have that. So that's basically the interior done with. Very, very retro, this car. I'm loving it a lot. The headlights, we will be changing to Zen on today. God, it's so nice. Now, liveries, I never knew we can get liveries for this. I'm just taking a look down them, guys. Not necessarily going to pick one. Zero gas. Mm, they're all pretty good, but I kind of like mine clean. Thank you very much. I'll be taking that very nice and clean. Livery, what have I missed? I've not missed anything yet. Now, the respray. I want to see what it does to the secondary colour, because I'm keeping this in the yellow. So that changes the side, doesn't it? The little side stripe down there and the roof. Okie dokie then. What's it like? Fully yellow. Oh yes, please! Oh, hello, that looks so much cleaner, man. Oh yeah, I'm having that. <laughs> Soon as I've seen that there, I'm like, yep, I know what I'm going for. Bloody hell, that's nice. Now, side skirts. Never knew this was an option. Um, I don't know. I'm going to be keeping this thing relatively stock because I know it's got a WRB. See, if I say that one more time, I'm going to fucking slap me in the face. RWB? <laughs> fucking hell, man. Holy shit, okay. That's kind of an interesting wing. Oh my god, that's the GT2 wing, isn't it? Man, oh man, this is awesome. Oh god, no. Oh my god. <laughs> BGW, I like how they're trying to get around the copyright. That's fucking brilliant. I'm very tempted by this fucking blooming GT2 wing. Now that I look at it, I think this thing's actually more like the GT2 wing, isn't it? It's a really, really tough decision between the drift wing and the high level spoiler, because. I do kind of want to put one of these on there because, no. don't get me wrong, it looks very, very nice the way it is, but it's a bit plain, isn't it? I think we're going to keep it clean because I've seen quite a lot of people that have put massive wings on, so I think we're going to try and stand out a wee bit and keep the cleaner look because that does remind me a little bit more of the Singer 911, so we'll be keeping it stock. So all that time, literally five minutes of pondering that I've cut out for nothing. So yeah. <laughs> That is kind of useless, but we are literally touching touching the tire with them arches. But it does look good. It does look very, very good. And I can hear someone, woman, wanting to get into the garage. 
Sorry, mate. I'm kind of customising my car here. I'm really liking it on these actual rims that are on it right now, but we will take a little bit of a gander. Apparently there is some newer rims in Benny's. I don't know if this is them here, but... Oh my god, they don't look nice on this car. They do not... Whoa, oh, wait a minute. Nah, actually no. <laughs> now that I look at it, I'm like, no, thank you, my friend. So I'm really liking the look of these Cosmos right here on this. Now, bear in mind, it's not chrome, so we still can change the colour, which is going to be pretty good. So I've got a funny feeling it'll look good in black. Yes, it does. Oh my god, we've got kind of like the chromish outline, like the lip. I like that style, man. Very, very cool. Very, very sort of retro as well. You're the look of tyres. And we'll have the white tyre smoke. So I don't know if I've missed anything, guys. It didn't really give us an option, I don't think, for um, blooming the plates, did it? Let me just take another quick look down. Don't think it did. So, yeah, guys, that is going to be the build of the brand new Pifster, I believe is how you pronounce it, Retro Comet. I really, really like what I've done to this thing. Just keeping it clean. I'm glad I didn't add the spoiler onto it. Black wheels, no window tint, so you can see everything into it. It's, it's bloody gorgeous. So, let's go ahead and take it out for a little bit of a spin. So here we are, we are at the docks and a bunch of you guys have actually turned up, so thanks for doing that. The Porsche looks very, very nice in this godlike freaking light right now. And someone has just turned up to the office. Hello! And I don't think I need to freaking explain who that is, so yeah, Andy's with us right now and we're going to do like a 10 minute session each light. I'm going to drive the thing for about 5 to 10 minutes and then he's going to do it, so I thought, may as well since it's snowing, we may as well have a little bit of dock snow drifting because this is one of the best areas in the game to actually do it. So apologies if the game volume is a little bit low. Uh, we could have turned it down so you can hear both of us. I think we got a message there, don't we? Sorry for shooting you. It's no bother, man. I'm in pass. I'm in pass mode anyway, <laughs> mate. So I don't think you could get me. What the fuck? Mental. But this thing's a little bit scary in the snow because, as we all know, the the 911 is rear engine, so it's got a lot more weight over the back end, which you would think would yeah. kind of give you more grip, but in the snow, it's a bit of a... It's got no weight over the front. Yeah, it's a, it's a little bit of a... I don't really want to call it jackknifing, yeah. but it's a very, very twitchy bastard in the snow. Oh my god. Ooh. But you can hold the drifts yeah. for a wee bit. Not as much as Forza, obviously, but... You keep on tapping the handbrake, well, you should be able to get The normal comet is good, it's one of the best cars for drifting in this game. Yeah, I'll agree with you on that one, it's really fucking good. I mean, I mean, that's probably the question for you guys. What other Porsches do you want to see Rockstar attempt to bring into the game? Because they've got the GT3 yeah. in the form of the... Well, I don't know, it's kind of like a... It's kind of like a GT3 slash turbo yeah. in it, the normal comet. No, the normal comet from GT4 was the turbo. Yeah, 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 and this so one this is... Turned into the GT3. Yeah, this one you could do kind of like many combinations. Yeah. You can obviously do RWB, you can do like an old GT2. Um, but yeah, personally I would like to see like a 944 Turbo, yeah. an old like... I think it's the 356 A Speedster. Yeah. Love to see that as well. And you'll, you'll probably hate me for saying this one. Don't you fucking dare! But Unless a, a Panamera one mi mixed with something. Unless it's the new Panamera, yeah. then yeah, I'm down for that, but the, the old Pan one, no. Pa Panamera makes up an RS7 kind of stick. Ooh, now that might be quite good. As long as you have, but well, that's the thing, right? See the new Porsche Panamera, yeah. the back end's the best part of it, yeah. and the RS7, the back end's the best part of it. Yeah. So, I don't know which one you would But since there's already kind of a for, Porsche Audi combo in this game that... Cayenne Q7 kind of thing. That's a good point, actually. I never thought of that. Whoa, the penguins going to fly in. <laughs> okay, okay. Penguins hey. don't fly. <laughs> <laughs> You've just got to believe. It's Christmas, man. Anything can happen. Fucking Santa can fall down your chimney and smoke some weed in front of you. Fucking mental. Didn't know that about Santa. <laughs> I, he, he apparently hangs around with Snoop Dogg at this time of the year. Just getting 420'd and fucking mad dogged. Crazy. 
and someone just kamikaze in a helicopter. Oh, now, I'm exactly. not. Whoa, shitty, shitty, bang, bang. <laughs> what the fuck? That was the slowest crash. I ever. know. <laughs> what the fuck? I mean, it was just a slight tap and all. I, I like the snow and I hate the snow for many, many reasons because the AI just are completely retarded in it. But we'll check out the interior. I freaking love this, man. <laughs> I'm really glad I made it all yellow because it, it just really, really pops. That fucking handbrake, though. Okay. Look where you're going, Frankie boy. You're nearly fucking flying around a pole. <laughs> I hate the fucking snow in this game. I like it for drifting, but for AI, as I said, they're, they're complete loonies. Oh, the most of the time. Well, yeah. But snow <laughs> ass. Oh. 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 Merry sideweirdness. <laughs> if that's a thing. There we go. We need. That's that's the petrol heads. Here for the magic touch. <laughs> Merry sideweirdness. <laughs> yeah. Okay. All we need now is the the baby stickness. <laughs> the baby stickness. What is that? The stickness. Does that sounds like a fucking car name, doesn't it? Oh, stick. No, no, <laughs> no, the stickness. Yeah. Is that not like the fucking. What am I thinking of? The Suzuki Ignis. <laughs> that's it. That's what I'm thinking of. <laughs> <laughs> I knew yes, he said it was something. That's the car of choice. <laughs> yeah, the Suzuki Ignis is your car of choice for Christmas freaking drifting and hoonigan about. Not really, though. Not really. I'd probably go for. I don't know, because. Obviously, you want something that is not too expensive. Like you just want a beater. So I'm going to take a, can I take a page out of Mr. ADHD's book here? Can I go for like an old Nissan 240, mm. something like that, and maybe like a, uh, I don't know, like I, I don't exactly want to flip around like a freaking old Cosy or something mm. like that, like an old Cosworth because they they're worth a lot, right? But maybe like a cheap GTS Skyline or something. I don't, I don't know, but. Yeah, just some old Japanese rear-wheel drive coupe, but yeah. I'll, I'll probably try and go for like an or something. That's a good point, I actually never thought of that. Ah, you could since, get Since they're kind of cheap. Yeah, well, it depends on what yeah. model you want, like the bug eye or freaking... Go for one. Yeah, I kind of want the, the, hat, the, the hatchback, I think it's the weight hatchback I want, but 2005 model's good, the yeah. new one is very good, one of my favourites, but... Yeah, <laughs> that's probably another question for you guys. If you could pick like any beat or anything like that for like snow, yeah, for like, snow drifting yeah. and just like hoonigan about, what would you pick? Because that's quite a tough choice when you think about it. Because you don't want to pick like a very expensive car because you'll bash it up and everything. Yeah. You just want a good old beat or. Where's the car going? going? I'm going off road in the car. Oh my god! <laughs> or, or fucking Chiron, however the fuck you pronounce or it. Chiron. Chiron! <laughs> Ed Chiron! Merci beaucoup, merci! Fucking hell! Okay, I'll let the charger go. Oh my god! Is a Mercedes rolling? Bloody hell! I knew that was going to happen, I knew as soon as we got on this road, Havoc was going to turn. Okay, so let's see if we can actually mosey on down and get a little bit of drifting going! It's actually not bad up here. If we had like a Fujimi Cairo road in this game, then holy fucking shit! I mean, all the drifters blowing heads will explode. Curve into each other. <laughs> oh my god, yes! Like, a fucking extension or something. Maybe even make it as a custom map. The minivan's beating you! <laughs> Morning! then! Sock him on! What the fuck are you doing, mate? There we go. Oh no, 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 no. <laughs> Don't want to go flying off the side. Sock him on! Oh god, it's the Bugatti now. There she is! She get fucking pelted off by someone. <laughs> Good! Don't ever drive a minivan around a Porsche. Because it'll cream you. Oh god. Get okay, one. Power down, power down. It sort of cuts the oh. pillar a little bit though. That's the one thing I've noticed. Okay. Uh, that red buddy we drift there. <laughs> Could you cast. Oh god! <laughs> <laughs> Could you class that as a rock tap, not a wall tap? Oh no, 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 a big squad of people. Oh my god, we got his fucking rape minute. <laughs> Give me your babies. Got the oh my god. Why are they raping the Sun Kings? <laughs> oh god, that suspension though. Oi. Oh, oh god, <laughs> didn't even notice that. This is a lot of fun though. Yeah. Definitely a lot of fun. We'll try and take it into Sandy Show. Oh, it's okay. Yeah, okay. 
You have been a fucking rebel, mate. Oh, okay, what the fuck's he doing? Just randomly <laughs> standing there. Watch out, mate, you're gonna get fucking taken out. He's like, I love the look of this snow, and then, ha! Let's get taken down by a Bugatti. <laughs> right, let's see if we can hang this one out. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yee! Yes! There we go! I've had a lot of fun driving this, so I'm gonna pass it over to Andy, right. see what he wants see to do I with do. it. So, this is actually kinda good. I can yeah. just lay you back, can, relax, you can sit back. <laughs> and watch the carnage unfold. Oh, and immediately he's gonna off road with it. That's a fucking good sign. Thank god I turned off the <laughs> <laughs> Boom goes the dynamite. Goes, boom goes whatever. Uh, where are you going anyway? Is that? Did you just see the Oh, is the wheels are coming through the arches? Oh hi! What the fuck? Okay. Let's get the Gurkha problem. <laughs> Holy shit! Oh, I know where you're going. Good idea. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, break, breaky, breaky. Don't go. Bricky. I was gonna say, don't go breaking my Porsche. <laughs> you couldn't if you'd fight. Oh, there you go. Right. <laughs> well, I can, mate. I can break the Porsche in a million pieces. I, I, could, I fucking know that, and that's what I'm terrified for. Seeing me after I crashed into like fucking 5,000 pedestrians. Yeah, hang it, hang it, hang it, hang it, hang it. Not fucking. <laughs> Jesus Christ. That is I keep forgetting your handbrake's not A. Yeah, RB's better, I think. Because A's a wee bit. It's kind of old school, but at the same time, you can just tap RB and then that's you. Spitting of flame. Spitting of the flame. Oh, shit. Shall I do the jump? No, you won't. Okay. Oh. <laughs> they do not bad, though. Oh. Can't remember which way. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, this goes the flying Bugatti. Holy shit, but let us know uh, what you're doing for Christmas, oh, guys. Like, are you just spend it with your family, or are you just, like, spend it by yourself? Hopefully, you'll spend it yeah. with family and friends, and that. that'd be the best thing in that. Um, personally, I think I'm just going to be staying in, just having a couple of drinks and everything. Uh, what about you, one? Well, I'm going to my aunt. Your aunt, so. Not bad then. Um, it's just generally spend it with family, having a good time in that, so. Yeah, um, I'll be back on Boxing Day, guys. I've got, I forgot to say this. Tomorrow there won't be a video, obviously, because it's Christmas. Yeah. But um, yeah, expect a video on Boxing Day, and then no more until the first of January. So I'll let you know. I'll let you know more information about that in Boxing Day's video, because I'll be explaining quite a lot for 2017. It's going to be good. It's going to be very, very good. Just like Andy's thrift in Europe. <laughs> I mean, when you think of a Porsche, a very lowered Porsche, <laughs> in snow, you automatically think about coming to a construction site, don't yeah. you? <laughs> you definitely do, That's don't you? That's what to my mind. Yeah, because you're, you're, you're crazy like that, bro. You're crazy like that, bro. Bro, 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 bro. There we go. Let's give a bit of a deep bit. Oh, shit. Oh, God, he's in the bush. <laughs> he's in the hedge. <laughs> Get out the hedge. Over the hedge. Okay, and where's what's his name? Bruce Willis, we need him. <laughs> I like how there was a sign back there, fucking Did you see that sign? Oh. It was like fucking loose loose surface or something like that. Well loose, no loose, fucking shit! Loose back in. I was loose back in. I think the Bugatti would be fucking brilliant on this. Because yeah. I tested it out, like, not recording. Oh, oh god! <laughs> Jesus. I tested out the Bugatti for like normal drifting when I wasn't recording. It's pretty damn ace, even though it's all-wheel drive. Whoa. What are you doing? <laughs> I and spent that. a lot of money on this car, you know, and you smashed the back fucking one day. How dare you? I suppose weight reduction though, but oh, apart from God, that. God, Lambo. Lamborghini. Lamborghini. Salamandra Lamborghini. <laughs> fucking hell. Wait, I think I've watched it. Did I watch that video? The, the 730S. Yeah. Even though it's not called the 730S yeah. edition, it's called the S. I mean, I still quite like that, but I do agree with them. It's a bit... We missed an opportunity. Yeah, kind of. <laughs> to start fresh or make another oh car. But I think since the Murcielago was around for like nearly 10 years, 
they want to do the same with the Aventador. It's the sort of thing where, um, like the LaFerrari and the Enzo and yeah. the 918 and the Carrera and that. So I think that's what they wanted to do. <laughs> yeah, I seen that a mile, mile away, mate. Fucking hell, there's a thing called a steering wheel for a freaking reason. <laughs> well, this car is kind of like a ramp anyway, if you can, if you can get it low enough. What the fuck? Oh god. What the fuck? Oi! There he goes. There goes the biker. Into a face full of snow. Jinky done Jeremy Clarkson's technique. He's jumping into it. <laughs> <laughs> That's probably one of the funniest episodes. Yeah. Gotta say, what was it James was listening to in the Beatles or the Dominator? Oh, take on me. Aye. Tank Slapper. Tank Slapper. And he's stuck. Oh, you fuck. Oh, God. Hello there. Hello. Would you like to see this bright yellow Porsche? Oh, nearly a rock tap. I think that's an official new thing in GTA a rock tap. If freaking if drifting was invented in caveman days, yeah. if they had cars in caveman days, it would be good to do a rock tap. <laughs> they want it. Is that a Porsche cave? Ah, <laughs> uh, it's, it's the tough, <laughs> the tough one. I do know you. <laughs> I do know you. I don't know where, but I do know you. But I got a rock tap. Well, I also went toboggan. <laughs> toboggan. <laughs> oh, oh fucking geez. hell! <laughs> Jeez Louise, you're not. That's not destructible. I was going to say, you're not Alex, mate. You're not <laughs> fucking Will It Roll King. Holy shit. Bloody hell. Bloody hell, mate. Bloody hell. hell. Bloody hell. Booger. Booger, that's what I was thinking. Booger. 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 So I think that was like, it was a really old episode of Top Gear we were watching, and it was like an Australian commercial or like an advertisement. And I could, was it for the two of Hilux? I think it was. Um, and we've seen, <laughs> we've seen this guy just go booger, booger, booger. <laughs> so any Australians watching these dudes actually still say that? Ooh. Booger, okay. <laughs> booger indeed. Booger indeed. Just freaking slamming right in there. It's a wall back there. High looks. Hey, perfectly timing. I can only imagine what them guys are going through with the freaking. <laughs> Proto and the Veyron. Well, the Veyron does have all-wheel drive, so it has got a little bit of an advantage. Oh no. What is it with you in dirt roads? Or <laughs> snowish, dirty roads? Sick. Oh no, I thought you were going to go straight up there. <laughs> like, uh, hell no. Hair to the now, no, no. No. Oh, oh no. <laughs> <laughs> is it really that bad for understeer? Is it actually? Well, Porsche. well, yeah, good point, actually. But Porsche, mm, it's, it's relatively, depending on the model, it's, the, the GT3 RS is really, really good, yeah, obviously. Yeah. But sometimes understeer can be pretty good, especially yeah. if you're on like a racetrack. Oh. Obviously not heaps and tons of it. Into the tree! <laughs> Into the tree! <laughs> Fucking Subaru's friend. <laughs> but yeah. If you have too much understeer, obviously that's a pain in the arse, but if you have a little bit, it just lets you know, like, sunny boy, you're gonna be a bit too quick. If you know what I mean, yeah. just fucking slow it down. Get out, you Polish. Boom. <laughs> how old is that now? And I was gonna say, how fucking old is that? Mental. Now, that's one thing we could talk about for Kim. What is the dank memes of 2017 gonna be? Holy yeah. shit. We've got freaking. What have we got now? We've got. Oh! oh we've got a flying biker. Um, there was so many this year, you survived. fucking count. There was that wee kid that goes, ah, I don't know. Oh. One, it's the wee, the wee, um, the wee kid that goes, ah, and there's been so many freaking vines about it. So annoying, but. You've not seen that? It's been fucking everywhere. Holy shit. That and, um, what do you call it? I, I don't, was John I, Cena this year? I think John Cena was at the start of the year, so that was one of my favourites this year. Slowly get quite annoying, but the one I can't stand is, um... I, I don't mind that boy, and, uh, Sadu. I quite like Sadu, but... What was the one I can't stand? I don't fucking know. It was really, really an irritating one. God damn, but that's what we've got lo looking forward to next year. Fucking... Dank most memes. Stupid memes. Most stupid memes, but... In terms of games... We've well, obviously got like Gran Turismo yeah. Sport, we've got Forza 7, we've got Need for Speed 2017. Uh, hopefully they've got freaking 
more than one body kit for each car, and we can actually unlock them. Oh my god, that wow. looks gorgeous. Wow! Wow! <laughs> wow. <laughs> the pink is coming out. <laughs> the pink is coming out, but I think that's quite a good time to end the video, isn't it? Yeah. That's pretty... <laughs> spectacular sight, spit it out, Junior. Uh, but yeah, guys, let us know what you make of the slightly crumpled Porsche <laughs> now um, down in the comment section below. Um, I hope you have a very Merry Christmas and yeah. you'll see me back on Boxing Day. And uh, yeah, anything yeah. else you want to say, man? Yeah, not really. And Merry Christmas to all. <laughs> Merry Christmas to all. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, hopefully I see you online on Christmas Day, yeah. guys. I would take my Xbox to my house so I can just chill out during the day, just have some fun on GTA and in Forza. So yep, we shall see you in my next video, guys. Thank you so much for watching, and bye bye. Bye bye. Back charger. We just get a back charger. <laughs> Fucking brilliant Christmas wish, mate. Thank you. There we go.